Welcome to another session of PLC Programming for Beginners. In this session we will see how to use set and reset instructions. Before starting please don't forget to subscribe Easy PLC Training Channel to stay connected with me. So today we will see how we can use the set and reset instruction in the PLC programming. Set instruction basically used to change the state of a bit to high or one. Once a bit is set high it will remain high until that bit is reset to low or zero using reset instruction. Let's go and make a sample program to have better understanding. In network 1 we will take set instruction in a open contact. Set instruction will set a indicator LED to high state once a rising edge or positive edge signal comes from normal open contact which is a push button 1 connected to PLC. In network 2 we will take reset instruction in a open contact. Reset instruction will reset a indicator lamp to low state once a rising edge or positive edge signal comes from normal open contact which is a push button 2 connected to PLC. Let's download this program to PLC. So this our PLC setup green push button is push button 1 connected at I0.0 .0 and red push button is push button 2 connected at I0.1, red LED indicator is connected at Q0.0 .0 PLC input. Now you can see if I press the green push button once it will set the output Q0.0 .0 LED indicator to high state and it will remain on even if I release the green push button. In order to turn off this indicator have to press the red push button 2 one time. Now as you can see I have connected memory bits M1.0 parallel to push button 1 and M1.1 parallel to push button 2. These memory bits have same effect on the set and reset instructions as with push buttons. Now if we change the state of memory M1.0 bit to high using shortcut control and F2, it will set the indicator LED state to high. Whereas if we change the state of memory make M1.1 bit to high using shortcut control and F2, it will reset the indicator LED state to low. Now there is a condition which we have see carefully, memory bit M1.1 is high and reset instruction is forcing the output LED indicator to low state. Remember reset instruction has priority over the set instruction means if the reset instruction is high at that time set instruction cannot change the state of the output to high. Now to can see that if I press the green push it can't set the output state to high. To set make the set instruction to work we have to change the reset instruction state to low. Now reset instruction state is low and set instruction should work now. If I press green button set instruction works normally and turn on the LED and upon pressing red button reset instruction turns off the LED indicator. Let's sum up all we studied in this session. If I press green push button and keep pressing it turns on the LED. Now keeping the green push button if I press the red push button it will turn off the LED because reset instruction has priority over set instruction and as soon as I release the red push button it will turn on the LED indicator again. I hope you like today's session, please subscribe to this channel to stay connected with me. We will meet again next weekend till then take care and bye.